For the autumn program, uh, I am trying to bring again uh, three choreographers that uh, haven't been seen in this show before. Uh, Jiri Killian for Gat and Land, uh, Uwe Scholl's Seventh Symphony, uh, and uh, Morgan Ronacre will do a creation uh, as well for us. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to Birmingham Royal Ballet Studio One for this live stream rehearsal of Uwe Schultz's Seventh Symphony. This work is named after Beethoven's Seventh Symphony, to which the piece is set. Um, Uwe Schultz first created this work back in 1991 for Stuttgart Ballet, after which he enlarged the work to 34 dancers for the Leipzig whilst he was director choreographer at the company. Um, it's a huge cast and a highly technical work, so it's a real challenge for our dancers. And they've actually only been rehearsing for seven or eight days now, and this is their first time without a mirror. So, yeah, it's going to be a real challenge. Um, joining us tonight is Rosa Munoz Mazanas, who was a principal at Leipzig Ballet and was part of the original cast of Uve at the Leipzig, um, enlarging the work. Um, dancing tonight are Momoko Hirata, Cesar Morales, and Matthias Dingman and two of our newest principals, Yao Chen Chang and Mickey Mitsutani, and last but not least, our newly promoted first soloist, Max Maslin. Um, Birmingham Royal Ballet will be uh, showing the UK premiere of Seventh Symphony alongside an autumn triple bill called Into the Music. This bill also features a brand new work by Morgan Runacre Temple and Yuri Killian's iconic Forgotten Land. Into the Music will be running at the Birmingham Hippodrome on the 21st and 22nd of October, after which it will be at Sadler's Wells from the 2nd to the 5th of November. Now, as always, we love to hear from you, so please, comments, questions are always welcome. And before we get started, let's quite say a quick hello to Rosa, and we're going to have a quick chat about Seventh Symphony. So, Rosa. Hello. Um, lovely to have you here. Thank You've been you. with us for a week now, and mm -hmm. heat wave aside, rehearsals have been going well, I think. So. Yeah. Brilliant. Yes. And um, are getting used, starting to get in the mood. <laughs> brilliant. It is, I watched it today and it's, it's mm -hmm. very technical. Um, mm -hmm. Could you just talk to our audience a little bit about the relationship between the movement and the music and mm -hmm. Uwe Scholz's choreography? Well, Uwe Scholz is known as to be the, choreo the symphonic choreographer of our century and of our times. And uh, uh, definitely uh, Seventh Symphony, it's really a clear example of this. So in this beautiful uh, symphony with all the moods, with all the, the uh, emotional that, that there is, there is uh, so choreographed on the, fourth, on the four movements of the symphony. And you really see the translation from the music notes into the bodies of the dancers. So each dancer belongs to a group of instruments. And so it's really like a translation of the, of the notes. Brilliant. Mm -hmm. And what are we watching tonight? Tonight we're watching a part of first movement. So we have our three principal couples from first movement. So it's really happy, uh, energetic uh, move, movements and feeling and emotions as well. Uh, if we get there, I don't know how far we get in the rehearsal, <laughs> but we may get, get also to the center of first movement, which is a very long and full and uh, very interesting movement with very extreme positions and extreme musicality too. So it's going to be a working rehearsal. It's not a performance because oh, course, we just yeah, yeah. learn. We're just getting into the, the, the movements. But while well, those brilliant dancers, I'm sure they're going to do a very good job. Oh, they're going to be great. <laughs> All right, let's get on with it. Thanks, guys. So hello. <laughs> Let's start with the second movement from the first movement, the second movement from the three movements. So we're going to have the end of the eight movements, and then we start drumming. Yeah? Just remember to keep, the, to, have, to keep this note there, da -dum, da -dum, da -dum, and then we want to do this big position here before we go. Then we want to go and say, sorry, we have this long hold, and let's try to keep the shape of the position, all three of us. Yeah? Just remember the lower we stay down, the quicker our shoulders are going to turn. So 
after the pulling to have this kind of on the jambe. Tape on the floor, yeah? Maybe it's you, Cecil, don't lift. One, that's better. And in. That's it. And you put, uh, so Cesar, you try yeah, to do the yeah. yeah? But the more that we have this on the jambe. Okay, let's try one uh, also, it's not music, those sweaters, yeah? Try to spot where we go exactly, yeah? Keep watch out with those arms, girls. Long arms and long arms, pass a second, pass a fast, yeah? Two arms here, that's it. And again, and pump, and pump, pass a second, fire and quick back. Yeah? Let's see it with our music clip. I count your three, yeah? Three is three. <laughs> so, and one, two, three. And down, and down, and up, and down, and down, and down, and up, fire, up. Yes, that's good. <laughs> Ladies, very good. I'm even faster than you. <laughs> so, after the fire, remember, we bring this lady in parallel. Don't turn out, yeah? And body waiting for the boy to check their hands. Yeah? Really nice seat that's that my pattern. And up to go. Okay, let's take it again from the real beginning, please. And we try to get to the boys to all there, yeah? Thank you.
come and the lady is going to be late. And the man is going to stand, the lady is going to be late, take one, take one, take one, and now catch your food. That's it. The more we catch the kids, the worse, the easier it's going to be to get up later. I think it's something that we have to do together. So we get the food as close from the body, and then try to bring your knee up to your nose, and then come to the left end of it. from the développé, yeah, I really would love to feel the tension. Two, two, three, four, and we start melting. Yeah, we pass into a completely different dynamic. That's it. Ladies, I think that if we have parallel arms here, now we're going to twist the shoulders, lean on the boy, and bring the arms like a wave. Yeah, it's a wavy feeling like the music is going wow, to grow the maximum voice. Yeah, and we try to développé like young time. Thank you. 
a soft position, yeah? Not the men. The men have a normal position. If you hear the others, it's very different. So we go one, bum, by ladies, and wait. like always, this arm is not too high, and we have the hand, the hand hanging there. We will have the water falling out. That's it. Bum, bum, bum. This had syncopated inside, yeah? And like always, we have this feeling with shorts, yeah? Not square, but we have this feeling, bodies, yeah, in young man but my chest is to the audience. Thumb, thumb, and the same. And up, yeah, looking at the audience, and always this feeling of opening here. The same for the man, yeah? So, plié, relevé, développé, passé, arms to the side, that I want, do. You really have an accent, right? Yeah? Soutenu, watching there, change your spot. Soutenu, and go to me, very nice, man. Thumb, 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 and the body. That's it, boys, the same, yeah? Let's try not to be here. Let's try to have this feeling that the full chest is to the audience. They're really being present in every cell that we do. Okay? That's good. That's very good. Could we go from the big, big accent? Yes. <clears throat> After this, my girls are saying, arms, huh? Pa pam. Pa pam. It's the arms we should do with them more than the legs. Yeah, we must be even more active with the other part. Okay. Let's go from the développé directly. Yeah, we don't do the, the way it was lovely. Mm -hmm. Let's go from the big, big développé. Could it be with Matthias? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I would love to see from here how we get really into the proper position. Yes, so we get the two diagonals, men and ladies in front. Thank you.
Um, we had some amazing comments. Uh, lovely to have Rosé Munoz Matvana in Birmingham from Alevex. Uh, fantastic, so much talent from Wendy Goodman. Sarah Lambert said, superb, I'm really enjoying this live stream. And Lois Smith says, what a treat to watch live. I wholeheartedly agree. Um, yeah, thank you. It's been an absolute pleasure. If you like what you see, please go to brb.org.uk for ticketing information. And before I leave, uh, now is a good time to remind you that Birmingham Royal Ballet will be featuring in the opening ceremony of the Commonwealth Games this time next week, Thursday the 28th of September. You can watch live on BBC One from 7pm. Um, we're going to leave you with a little trailer of our rehearsals for the opening ceremony of the Commonwealth Games, and I hope you enjoy it, and we look forward to seeing you in a theatre very soon. Thank you, guys.